Good afternoon, welcome to Cook and Barbecue 24 seven. Today I have a great recipe I'm looking forward to sharing with you guys. So let's get cooking. Hello family, today we're cooking slow cooked llama beans. Today I have my seven quart Hamilton Beach slow cooker on high, getting ready to get this pot rolling. And as you can see, I'm gonna get here, start adding my meat, and you will see the secret meat that I add to my llama beans that it gives it great flavor. My family loves it and I really like it. Here we are adding the smoked turkey necks in that um that is traditional. And here is the secret meat. This is about a half a pound of cubed up chuck rolls. Cubed up beef chuck rolls. I add this to my llama beans, give it a great beefy flavor. I love it. It turns out great. I also added one large onion and I'm also gonna add a half a bell pepper and that's gonna get these beans nice and seasoned. These beans are gonna cook overnight and um, this meat is gonna be tender. The beans are gonna be great. And here I'm adding my, I think it's gonna be two tablespoons of garlic. And in the description below, I have the, all the exact ingredients. And right here, I'm adding my chicken base. And then right after that, I'm gonna add some fresh ground black pepper. And adding all these seasoning and spices with the peppers and onions, and we're gonna give this a good stir. And then I'm also going to add about two cups of water and that's going to bring the water up until about halfway up onto the turkey and onto the meat. Don't want to add too much water and make our beans soupy, but about, about two cups of water, give it a good stir and we're going to get the meat cooking and give that an hour head start over the, before we add the beans. And here we are, we're about to add our lima beans. This is a 16 ounce bag that's been washed and soaked for eight hours of baby lima beans. We're gonna add this in, give this a stir, and then we just gauge the water. I don't want it too soupy, but we're gonna add the water, hot water, bring it up to just barely covering the, the top beans. And we're gonna go from there and let this cook overnight on low. And man, in the morning, this beans should be good to go. So we're going to see. And here, I think it was a little bit too much uh, liquid, so I removed some of it, put that off to the side. And what I do to help um, save that liquid, what I do is stick it in the microwave for about five minutes, let the microwave reduce it. And then when I need to add more liquid later, I use that liquid that's been uh, reduced. This is the level of liquid you want. It's right at the beans, not too soupy. I'm about to put this lid on, turn the cooker to low, and I'm about to go to bed and get some rest. In the morning, these beans should be perfectly done, seasoned, tender, meat should be tender, beans should be awesome. See you guys in the morning. If you guys are liking this crock pot video so far, please hit the like button and also consider subscribing to my channel for more crock pot, more seafood, and more barbecue videos. That'll really, really help the channel. Thank you. This is the next morning. Man, the kitchen smells awesome. I'm about to take this lid off, give it a good stir, see what we got. Did we burn it? Did we overcook it? Let's cross our fingers. So here we are. Wow. They look good. Everything is done. I'm going to taste for seasoning. Look at that. The meat is tender. Everything's looking good. I'm going to give it a good stir.
it was lacking a little black pepper that's a lot of beans we got over a pound right at a pound of beans a lot of turkey meat a lot of beef we need a lot of uh seasoning i didn't add any more salt from the smoked turkey and our chicken base had plenty of salt but um these beans were awesome um they turned out very well look at me stirring it um the turkey necks are falling off the bone the beef is nice and tender that beef just adds another level of flavor another level of richness i know it's untraditional but that beef chuck roast is a game changer and just a recap the full description and recipes in the description below i appreciate you guys for watching please like comment and subscribe i answer all my comments and i will see you guys soon until next week cook and barbecue 24 7